a brief history of glyphosate. It's now the number one herbicide in use, both in the US and throughout the world. It was patented by Monsanto um, as an, an herbicide in 1969. So it's been around for a very long time. Uh, we started getting poisoned by it in 1974. They started using it to control weeds in the environment. It came out from under patent in 2000 and inhibits an enzyme in the chicken mate pathway involved in the synthesis of tryptophan, tyrosine, and phenylalanine, which are the three aromatic amino acids. And there was a huge expansion of GMO, corn, soy, cotton, and canola crops in the late 1990s, which has led to sharp increases in the use of glyphosate over the past two decades. And that really has a lot to do with the increased resistance of the weeds. As they used glyphosate on these GMO crops, many of the weeds evolved to be resistant, so they had to use more. And that's why it kept uh, usage here kept going up over time as the as the weeds became resistant. And now we're kind of in a crisis where glyphosate is simply not working on certain very resistant weeds, and they're having to introduce other chemicals besides glyphosate into the formulations to control those resistant weeds.